very important. Something that most of y'all do on an everyday basis, females and males. Something that's taking a toll on your body, something that's messing with your mental health, something that's stopping you from being the best that you could possibly be. Something that's stopping you from reaching the girl that you want. Something that's stopping you from reaching the, the guy that you want. Something that's literally keeping you fucked up in the head, bro. Hold on. Cool. So look, first of all, Y'all see I'm getting the sun from y'all see I'm getting the sun from my room. I will be out there, man. Y'all know it be hot as bro. It be so fucking hot in Arizona to the point I gotta start coming indoor to sun gaze. Now you can sun gaze indoor, but it's best that you go in nature, take your shoes, socks off, and nigga get some of that energy from Mother Nature. But um you can sun gaze if you in a if you bro, no matter where you see the sun, if the sun beaming, you can get that energy from the sun, bro. It's that simple. Inside, I'll, I don't give a fuck where you at. Underground, they still getting energy from the sun. Now, listen. Let's talk about porn, bro. Do I, do I watch porn? No. Have I watched it? Obviously. I'm pretty sure every male and female have watched porn. I have stopped watching porn for oh, so long, bro. And the last time I actually watched porn was probably like a year and a half ago. I can't even remember. But... Obviously, I had females living with me. I had shit that I could do. I don't, I don't need to watch porn. Now, let me tell y'all something. Let me give y'all some examples, some quick examples. This video not going to be no that too, too long. Let me tell y'all what porn really do to y'all. This is for my young niggas. If you over the age of 15 and you don't know what NoFap is, no, that's tough. I've been knowing what NoFap is before I was even a YouTuber. I've been knowing what NoFap was before I even started medic. Well, even uh, thought about meditating. No vibe is something that been brought up for a while now, and I thought it was complete bullshit. And it's some of the hardest things you could ever do in your life. No fap is when you stop masturbating and stop watching porn. Now let me give you an example of when you stop masturbating and stop watching porn every single day. For y'all niggas that jack off every day, it's okay, bro. It's billions of y'all. It's okay. Let me tell you what you're doing to your life, big fella. You see all these shoes right here? I got like 50 pair of shoes, 50, 60 pair of shoes. Right? Big ass bedroom. Room dirty though. Got a big ass flat screen right over the bed. I got everything a girl could possibly. I need I got a walk-in bathroom. I got a mirror right here. I got all that shit. I got everything a girl could possibly need, right? I got money. I got new cars. My own house. I'm single. But if I was watching porn and masturbating every single day. No matter how much shit I got, it's still going to be hard for me to talk to girls in real life. I'm going to have social anxiety. I'm going to be scared to talk to females. Not even if... I won't even call it scared. Nervous around females. Nervous around crowds. I'm nervous in general in real life, but I'm a god on my phone. Watching porn calls social anxiety. Watching porn is the reason why you probably scared to talk to girls in real life. If you wasn't watching porn, you can go and pull Beyonce if you wanted to. You can go and you would walk up to Rihanna without even thinking you have nothing to offer for them. But you are at your natural, your natural alpha state. Porn programs your brain. Porn is so fucked up, you will find yourself masturbating to some shit that you would never do in your life. That's how fucked up it is. It's a fantasy. It's taking you away from real life girls. It's taking you away from your real true love. It's taking you away from your real true powers. Ladies, if you if you got dudes that you like, if you constantly at home letting all your good energy out and letting all this bad energy in while you watching porn, you will never attract that guy that you want because you will be scared to go out there and approach him. All you used to is what you're seeing on your phone. Most of the shit you're seeing on your phone, you probably would never, ever, ever talk to them type of persons or meet that type of girl in real life anyway. You don't want to. Them motherfuckers are done. If you do porn, I don't know what's I don't know what's gonna save you. You gonna have to go within, obviously. Now listen, the dark side of porn is it's taking your superpowers away from real life women, bro. All you wanna do is stay at home and jack off and be on your phone. It's easy to message girls on the phone. What conversation is you gonna have? With a girl that you like in real life if you met her and you watch porn. 
Because all you're going to be thinking about is fucking her. All you're going to be thinking about is sex. When you stop watching porn, you will be conversating with the girl that you like literally about every fucking thing on earth. You will be naturally conversating with everybody. You have no, it's no such thing as social anxiety when you go on NoFap. Now, let me tell y'all, I went on NoFap for 16 days and I noticed something in two weeks. It was some of the hardest, it was harder than meditating, bro. Yes, not having sex for 16 days is hard, bro. But the hardest things for you is the best things for you. I love the challenge. I love my life. I love me. I always try shit. And this was two years ago. When you sit at home, you laying down in bed and you watch a porn, man, you letting out all your fucking everything. Have you ever wondered why do you feel like you nervous when you go to school or when you around people or when you're in a crowd? Why do you feel nervous like something going to happen when nothing is going to happen? You wake up every single day nervous in crowds, nervous in public. And you know ain't nothing going to happen, but it's just natural, right? But when you at home, you be comfortable as fuck while you masturbating to porn. A lot of y'all masturbate for stress relievers, for stress relievers. You think that that's taking your stress away. But when you go to a party or a club or you have to approach a girl or talk to a girl, you have not two words to say to her and all you have on your mind is sex. Your mind has been programmed. To not be able to do what you really, really supposed to do. Find your motherfucking right one. You would never be able to find your right one if you watching porn. Because your right one is not going to be watching porn. And if she is, both of y'all going down the wrong road. Y'all not meant for each other. Porn is made to destroy us. We don't need that shit. Bro, when we was younger, we couldn't do that. What y'all doing now? We didn't have phones, bro. We had to sneak and get a paper, a, a magazine or something. Now, y'all niggas, y'all little virgins can go on y'all phone right now and watch anything y'all want to watch and nothing happens. Little do y'all know when y'all turn like 18, 19, when y'all start getting older and y'all start learning what anxiety and all this different shit mean, man, y'all niggas going to be fucked up in the 12th grade. Y'all going to be scared to talk to females in the 12th? You scared to talk to girls in high school, bro? If you are nervous around girls, bro, listen to me. If you are nervous around girls and you have everything to offer for her, but you don't know how to talk to her, you don't know how to approach her, you got to think of what you want to say. And for girls too, and you got to you 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 got to figure out what can I you got you going you got all this shit going in your head for a regular conversation with a person. It's because you watch porn. You have social anxiety from porn. From masturbating to porn. Most people on their phone, most of the people y'all see, these pretty ass females, they are weird and have social anxiety. I have met so many weird Insta, Insta famous girls in real life. They are totally different. What you put out there on social networks, you could put, you could make your life anything you want it to be. When you meet certain people in person, a lot of people look rich but broke in real life. A lot of rappers are not really popping. A lot of people who quote unquote claim they rappers are really promoters. They just got access to the stage because they are a promoter. Everything you see on Instagram is a distraction. Everybody is living their life through other people. You want to focus on yourself. You don't want to have to watch porn or do this or do that to get to feel good. Because all you're doing is taking away from what really feel good. That real fucking girl. The real thing. You could go and you could you could you could watch porn every single day and easily go out and fuck with thoughts and shit. I'm talking about the girl that you really like. A thought is a thought. They for everyone. But if you really want to find true love and you really want to be able to talk to anybody and walk in a room with your chest held high, not nervous, a alpha, immortal. Stop watching porn right now. Go on no fat. It's going to be some of the hardest thing you ever had to do. Try to do this shit. You're going to relapse. It's, it, it happens. Don't look at it like, oh, I relapse. It's over. Because you notice when you relapse, you notice your superpowers go away. It's real life superpowers when you go on no fat. Real shit.